Hello and welcome. My name is Chuck. I'm Old Man Tara. We're going to do a reading today for Friday, October 22nd. Friday, October 22nd, 2021. Our readings concentrate on our more senior crowd, the 55 and over crowd. Our question today is what are my opportunities for Friday, October 21st or 22nd, 2021? Uh, if you like what you see here, please do like and subscribe. Uh, if you hit the notification bell, you won't miss any of my daily senior tarot readings. Our first card today is the tower. Tower represents a sudden change of things. Uh, this change looks bad, but generally um, it's the change is because uh, this tower is built on a bad foundation or some lies. So the sudden change, while it's, it's traumatic and it's sudden, um, and it can, can cause some, some trauma, uh, it's needed uh, because this tower is built on a bad foundation or is built on lies, it's gonna collapse anyways. The next uh, card is the Four of Rods. Four of Rods is a celebration card. These folks are all going out, looks like they're going out on a picnic. Uh, rods are actions and uh, your fire, uh, fire energy. Looks like the, the Four of Rods also indicates that you have had some success a successful business, a successful relationship. Uh, possibly you're going out on this picnic to celebrate your, your successes. Uh, next card is the star. The star indicates that you are on a path, uh, a destined path. This is almost like the Christmas star that they, uh, they, they were following. Uh, the star also takes you over a lot of water. Water represents your emotions and your intuitions. Water can get into all the cracks where you can't see sometimes and your intuition brings forth um, a, a clear path. The star also indicates that you do have a clear path to your destiny. Uh, next card is the Six of Rods. The Six of Rods is a celebration card. And this is a public celebration. You can see all the public here celebrating you, cheering for you. Uh, this is definitely a card of success. Uh, this probably goes with your Four of Rods. Four of Rods indicates an early success in business. This tends to, tend to contain uh, business or relationships. This tends to indicate a later success, a more public success. Um, so you're going to have some public success and some celebration on Friday. Final card is the Four of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles uh, reminds you that while you're successful, you do need to share your success with others. The more that you share, the more that you give, uh, the more that you give back for yourself. This gentleman is successful. He has lots of coins, lots of pentacles. Looks like he has some food or potatoes here. And he has some firewood here. But all these possessions are weighing him down and he really doesn't look very happy. He knows that there's people here that are needy um, and he has this wealth. He should share his wealth with the people that are needy. He has this wall blocking him from these people. Um, the only way to be happy in the world is to share, is to help other people. The more that you help other people, the more that you give, the more that you put forth into the world, the more that you get back and the happier you will be. All right, if we look at all five cards, Friday might start with some type of a, a change, uh, some type of a sudden change. But I think this change is overweighed by your successes. Um, you're, you're, uh, you're going out on a, a party and a picnic. Um, so this indicates success. So this change, if it is a change, it's only going to aid with your success. Uh, this success means that you're, this star means that you're on a destined path. You're going the right direction. Your successes continue and the very public success. You're cheering. You're like, yes, finally. Um, so I think you're on a, a, a great path. Your prior successes are gonna to lead to your future successes. Um, with all this success, don't forget to share. Share what you have. Share what you have with people that need. The more that you share, the more that you will unburden yourself and the happier you'll become. You don't see him with a whole lot of coins and potatoes and everything holding him down and look how happy he is. When you hold on to your possessions too tightly, when you forget to share with those in need, then you become miserable and weighed down by your possessions. That's it for Friday. Look for a big celebration. Thank you for tuning in. My name is Chuck. I'm Old Man Tara. Thank you.